I have the pleasure to be here with Dr. Vivia Fowler, president of Wesleyan College. Dr. Fowler, thank you for your time. The Tubman Museum, iconic in many ways, the centerpiece to downtown. When you head downtown and you make contact with it, what goes through your mind? I think about our students. Wesleyan College, as you know, is a very diverse, has a very diverse student body. We have about 25% international students and about 30% African American students. And we benefit from this rich diversity on this uh, residential campus. And it's important for our community to have Wesleyan with its diversity and to have the Tubman Museum offering to the people of Central Georgia uh, this experience. Your college dates back to the 1830s. Harriet Tubman was born in 1822. When you think about that, what goes through your mind? Well, Harriet would have been 14 years old in 1836 when uh, Wesleyan College was founded by some very brave people in, in Macon who thought that women should have the same education as men. Unfortunately, uh, the South was a different place then, and we're talking about white women and white men. Uh, fortunately, Wesleyan today looks very different than it did in 1836, and we would welcome Harriet to come to Wesleyan College, and many Harriets, many, many, many of her descendants and, and pe people who uh, followed in her legacy. When you think about the Tubman Museum, and you think about your fine institution here, why partner with the good people at the Tubman Museum? What is it about that institution? What is it about the people that run that place that say to you as the president here, we want to be in partnership with them? I think we share the same values. The values of diversity and inclusion, the values of making contribution to making Macon and Middle Georgia a good place, a, a welcoming place, a place that celebrates the history of all of our people and a place that celebrates both diversity and inclusion. From the educational side, why is it important for you to have some of your women get down there and see the museum and if they have the money to get a student scholar, a student membership, which is $20 a year, why would you encourage them to do that? Well, there's so much history there, so much history of Macon, uh, to tell the full history of Macon, maybe a history that they didn't learn grew up in Georgia. Most of our students are from Georgia, if they're from the United States, Georgia and surrounding areas, so we have a lot of students from the South. And the Tubman Muse Museum preserves the full history of our, uh, of our region and our town, uh, certainly the history of African Americans in the United States and in the South that we need to we need to know.